What's going on everyone? We are back with another 82 no challenge video. Um, sadly, 2 KMT Central is still kind of broken where it's giving a lot of those uh, card generating or generating player cards or whatever. Uh, so we do have to do it the same way we did last time where we're just opening individual packs and um, if it gives all of those card generating players, we're just going to have to open another pack, but we're going to do boost drafts for everything. Um, we're going to do lowest overall, uh, but for the last five picks, I get to choose any player I want out of those packs. Most of the packs are only going to give one, two players, so I might not even get a choice regardless. So uh, let's get this going with pack number one, and we're going to get World Be Free. He is retired, so we can't choose him. We are doing a rebuild, of course, so we can only choose active players, and oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't even care what happens for the rest of this draft. We just got Luka. I think this is the first time we ever got Luka in any of these drafts, and this is going to be crazy, so this might actually be an 82 no challenge video. Uh, Robin Lopez is the lowest overall here, so definitely not as good. I would have loved to get Brooke there, honestly. Brooke would have been really nice uh let's go let's go let's go let's see what we've got and yep all card generating so got to repick that one let's see what we get as we get wesley matthews let's see pick number four here give us something good oh okay actually jared allen is not bad bam would have obviously been way better but jared allen is definitely not a bad pull all right we got pack number five here and honestly this team's looking pretty nice uh oh my gosh dude the, they dude, these people need to get this fixed bro they need to and we get two retired players so we can't even choose them oh this is so frustrating uh we get nico melly okay all right we got pack number six here and we're gonna get cj mccollum yo this is a dub this is a dub all right we got pack number seven come on give us some good give us some good gear fox that's a dub bro so our starting lineup right now would be De'Aaron, CJ, Luca. Uh, no one would be at the power forward yet, but then we have Jared Allen at the center, which is honestly a pretty fire starting lineup. Oh man. We, so we just need a really quality power forward as we get Shabazz Napier. So, all right, this is our last pack where we choose lowest overall and then we get to choose whatever player we want. So this could be really, really good. Uh, we do get Al Farik Aminu as our last guy definitely not going to get any minutes all right here is where it's very important that we get good players we need really really good players here as we get lonzo ball or terrence ross this is a rebuild so i think i'm gonna go with lonzo ball because i think he will have better trade value even though i'm pretty sure he is a lower overall i think terrence ross is an 80 and lonzo is like a 78 or 79 but as a shooting guard lonzo will go up so that's actually pretty nice uh as we get Shaq or mystery player here uh i didn't say the uh, i didn't say this yet so i don't want uh, i'm not gonna implement it for this draft because i forgot to say it and i don't want to act like i'm cheating uh but in the future what we're gonna do is if we get mystery player we get to um we basically get our choice of player at that overall uh but it seems like all the mystery players are 81 overall so i don't know how much i want to actually do that now because i haven't seen any other overall besides 81 so i might not actually do that uh for this pick this, so this is now officially pick number 11 and we get bielitsa all right we got three more picks left best player was still our first pick luca um hopefully we can get someone good tj warren honestly 85 overall that's pretty fire all right second to last pick right here Come on, give us some decent at least. Decent at least. Kelly, yeah. All right, kind of a letdown there, getting Kelly Olynyk, but we are officially on our last pull. Come on, give us some fire. Oh, two retired players. Here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go again. Give us some good. Give us some good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. AI. That would have been fire. I should have done uh, just like all players. I should have done all players because we could have had Shaq already. We could have had AI, bro. This challenge would have been easy as we get Tyler Hero. Yo, that's a dub. Uh, he's pretty. I think he's pretty underrated in 2K. Um, but you know what? By the time next gen comes out, I would assume that his um, attributes are all up to date um, because he should definitely be over an 80 overall. And I think he's like a 77 in the game or something like that. Uh, but he should definitely be like 
probably like an 82 overall i would think honestly all right so we're here and this is what the lineup looks like uh definitely a fairly solid lineup we're definitely gonna need a better starting power forward um and then maybe upgrade the bench a little bit uh but definitely um this team definitely looks really nice so far all right we actually don't have too many uh big contracts so we're gonna try and get Kristaps Porzingis, um and we are gonna have to give up cj because again uh the way the contracts are uh that's just what we have to do uh is do we have a young guy um who would have a lot of value okay what about lonzo uh, then we have to make up some money. So let's just take this guy and then let's give them a first two firsts. Okay. There we go. All right. I actually really like this trade Jared Allen and Courtney Lee, um, for Clint Capella. Um, the main reason I'm doing this is yes, Clint Capella is a slight upgrade over Jared Allen, at least overall wise, but we're getting this very, very good, uh, first round pick from Atlanta. All right, I actually want to try and get Clay Thompson from the Warriors, and we're obviously going to give that first round pick. Oh my gosh. I really don't know what it's going to take to get Clay Thompson, uh, but just because he's a better defender, I really want him uh, at my two. Uh, and we're going to give up a lot for him. Okay, yeah, we're not going to get Clay Thompson. All right, we're going to try and get Carl Anthony Towns from the Timberwolves. Um, we're going to give that first round pick. I don't know what it's going to take to get him. Um, I don't know if he's more valuable or what, but it sucks because Minnesota is actually buying right now. So I don't think we're going to make this trade work. All right. We are going to try and go for Kyrie Irving now. Uh, we're going to go with that same first round pick. I don't know what it's going to take to get Kyrie, uh, but this team would be absolutely fire with him and we can't get Kyrie. All right. I don't know how easy it's going to be to trade for Bam. They want De'Aaron Fox that I cannot do. Uh, but let's see if anybody has some good trade value who I'd be willing to trade away. I mean, again, I'd I would go with Kelly Olynyk, but we will have to get someone back. And Iggy doesn't have too much, much trade value. Uh, I don't want to give up that first yet, so I will go up, give up a different first and a bunch of seconds. No, 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 no. Two seconds, three seconds. Oh my gosh. All right, we're gonna go with TJ Warren and Bielitsa um, instead and see if we can get this trade to work. And then we're gonna give that first round pick. Oh my gosh, dude, I'm really doing this just be so Jimmy Butler becomes easier to trade for. All right, this is the trade we're gonna try and get to do for Ben Simmons. We're gonna give that Atlanta first round pick, which is literally so valuable. And we're gonna go three seconds. They're not interested, but that means it's close. So we're gonna give up a first. Uh, they have a counter offer two seconds and they also give shake milton yes i'm fine with that all right we're gonna make this trade for draymond green we're giving robert covington and alfred Gamino up we're also getting a first round pick uh but the reason is to just get a big contract in draymond green to get another solid player all right so we are going for bradley beal we are giving draymond green and bealitza up and then i'm willing to give up a bunch of first round picks come on four first round picks we can't get this done with four first round picks. All right, we do have to give up Bielitsa and Draymond, but we are getting Stephen Adams back who will have a uh, better trade value than Draymond Green. All right, we're just gonna do Stephen Adams and a bunch of picks and we'll see if we can get it done this way. I hope we can. Four first round picks and Stephen Adams got Bradley Beal. All right, I meant to show this trade. I didn't think it was gonna go through so fast, but we ended up getting Mitchell Robinson for Shabazz Napier and a first. So this is what the uh, starting lineup is probably gonna look. Wait, what? Wait, why isn't Luca starting? Why is Luca not starting? I am so confused. Luca is starting over De'Aaron Fox. All right, so this is what the starting lineup right now looks like. Luca, Bradley Beal, Ben Simmons, Chris Stops, and Mitchell Robinson. Honestly, probably the best starting lineup that has ever been assembled. Uh, no cap. Uh, and then off the bench, we have Darren Fox, TJ Warren, Tyler Hero, who I like all of them. Uh, but we do need a center for off the bench and a bad, so we need better big men for off the bench. And that's really it. All right, here we go. Here's a trade. I really like Alex Lennon two first for Christian Wood and Jordan McRae. And we're probably just going to move Jordan McRae for a backup center. All right. And Mo Wagner in the first can get us Jared Allen. So I think the team is set now. 
All right, so the final lineup is looking like Luca, Bradley Beal, Ben Simmons, Chris Stops, and Jarrett Allen. And then off the bench, we have Darren Fox, TJ Warren, Mitchell Robinson, Christian Wood, and Tyler Hero. 10-man lineup. Really like it. System proficiency is definitely not going to be bad or defense. Looks like seven seconds is actually really good. Um, yeah, seven seconds looks better than balance. Jared Allen doesn't do well in balance, but he does do good in seven seconds. So I am going to keep the team at seven seconds. And let's see how good we can do. All right, first attempt to 82 and 0 challenge. We have 73 and 9. Not terrible. Not great. Great would be like getting like 79, 80 wins. So a little disappointing, but um, it's okay. We were the 64, 65 Celtics and Luca gets all NBA second team. Uh, we have no one on the all defensive team though. Uh, yeah, obviously we're first seed. What am I, what am I thinking right now? Yeah. Point differential was only 19 and a half. Usually our best teams get about 25, um, 26, but that, I guess that was when we were having like all time great players on the team. Uh, this is just um, like current NBA players, but as far as our offense goes, Luca killed it with 24, Bradley Beal with 21, Porzingis and Darren Fox both put up about 17, and uh, Ben Simmons still put up 14. Surprisingly, uh, I thought he would have it would have just been playmaking for him. But rebounds, Kristaps uh, eight and a half, Luca eight, Jared Allen eight. Holy crap! And then assists per game, Luca nine and a half, and then Ben Simmons at eight, and Darren Fox at seven. Uh, field goal percentages look really, really nice. Uh, do we have any 50, 40, 90? We do not, but Bradley Beal shot pretty well. Tyler Hero shot fantastic for us off the bench. Holy shit. That's amazing. Uh, we got Cleveland in the first round. We apparently always have Cleveland in the first round, it seems like. Uh, we did give them Rashawn Holmes, though. Uh, but simulate round, not scared, 4-0. Uh, close that game. Bradley Beal dropped 36 and Luka dropped 32. Uh, ben Simmons had 12 assists, so let's go. Milwaukee probably doesn't look any different. Um, I don't think we made a trade with them. Uh, but we did take Robin Lopez off of their team, which probably doesn't do much. Holy, mm, bro. Oh my gosh. I was about to get so, so mad. Yo, Bucks came back in that fourth, uh, but we destroyed him in OT. Uh, and we probably went, yeah, that was probably double OT actually. That was, that was probably double OT. We killed him in second uh, overtime. Uh, but ben Simmons, De'Aaron Fox. Uh, can we go like, uh, I wish we could go quarter by quarter uh, team stats. Uh, because that would be really, really nice to look at. And they didn't even play super well. All their percentages were way lower besides free throws. Uh, but we got Boston in the finals who literally always give me problems. I have probably failed two or three rebuilds already in 2K21 because of the Celtics. Uh, but let's simulate the round and we beat them 4-1. So that's really nice. Um, eh, no one really took over. It was just great team offense. Holy, everybody did amazing besides Tyler Hero. But that's okay. Uh, we got the Clippers in the finals who probably don't look any different. Yeah, they don't look any different. Uh, simulate. Oh my gosh. They blew a 3-1 lead. Luka came back from a 3-1 deficit. Let's go. Okay. Well, that was our second attempt to 8 2 no. uh, challenge in 2k um it's kind of disappointing they have to be so different because 2k mt central's website sucks because they're not giving like actual cards they're just giving player generated cards but there you guys go with our second attempt i think at the 8210 challenge i hope you guys enjoyed um and yeah peace mm -hmm.